it's nice, warm, sunny days during the day, evening comes around, that monsoonal moisture. Right, nice because we get the rain and not too much flooding, but there's still that threat of that ahead. So a very similar setup as Stephanie mentioned for today and ahead with slightly lower temperatures though ahead because of even more rainfall, a pretty high chance of flash flooding from the San de Cristo Mountains, even parts of the Jemez Mountains, all the way down south to the Sacramento Mountain chain as well. These areas not only getting the potential for heavy rain, but pockets of hail, strong winds, frequent lightning, but from Albuquerque westward, especially in the western half of our viewing area, lower chances for flash flooding, as well as parts of the southern and eastern parts of the Pecos River Valley. We're sitting at 67 in the Duke City right now and a couple hours from now warming up in the low 70s. Pretty pleasant heating up in the low to mid 80s by noon then heating up in the low to mid 90s before the afternoon commute that will start to cool off because of strong thunderstorms perhaps in the 80s or even cooler as those storms a little bit more likely ahead. Now this morning mostly clear skies across much of the metro showers dissipating near Las Cruces and a vein of strong thunderstorms once again near the northeastern highlands dissipating in coverage and intensity more on the Texas side of things. Pretty widespread rain across our viewing area later today this weekend, but less likely by Tuesday and I'll be tracking that weather pattern change ahead back to you.